guys. We're just uh, heading out to meet up with Dwindle's Dream Charters out of Kim Carden. It is 5.55 a.m. Uh, running a little bit late today, but we're going to make the best of it. And I think the plan is we'll be targeting lake trout and salmon. So, we will see you guys soon. grab ice for our cooler to put the fish in. The side. Yeah, there's that. That's it right there. And there's bait there, but we don't need bait. There she comes with the ice. We're putting it in the white rock cooler. These things are amazing. So yeah, just toss them in like that. We can uh, take care of that once we get there. Perfect. We made it. We have arrived at our destination. Looks like that's our rest of our crew right here in front of us. Alrighty, let's get going. Is that a hotel or is that condos? Nice. Way to go! Nice job! Woo Good start. Wow. Nice, James. Well, I mean, I didn't really do much. It was nice fish, bro. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Got the matrix. Just enough movement while you were bringing yeah. it up and down. Beauty. Matrix. Matrix, yeah. Ooh, that's a nice one. There we go. Come on. Just a couple hours, hey. Hey! That's fishing. Patience. Freshwater shark, huh? Yep. Yeah. Yeah, that's a lake trout. Nice job. Nice, nice fish. Good fish this lake by golly. There you go. Nice, Richard. Ooh. Hey, Richard. Oh, one. Nice one. Yeah. Nice fish. She knows what she's doing. <laughs> No head shakes? Ooh, that'd be nice. 315. No, I changed it. We got a pressed ice on there. I think it's 
Oh, come on. 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 O
I forgot to record. All right, so I got the barbecue fired up. I'm now gonna put the trout on. So what I did is I put some olive oil down. Here, let me switch this. Uh, I guess I can't. I put some olive oil, and then after that, I added the trout. Put some olive oil on top of that. And then salt and pepper. And I was kind of going for a little bit of an Asian-inspired uh, dish. So I actually used some poison sauce with sriracha. And then I put avocado on it, uh, white onion, um, shallots or green onion, some sesame oil, and I believe that was a, oh, a little bit of butter as well. So I'm kind of just experimenting. That's what I typically do when I cook food. I just kind of wing it. Sometimes it's a hit, sometimes it's a miss. I'm hoping this one's good. So we will uh, walk you through the process here and we'll go from there. Okay, so I'm gonna, I got it wrapped in foil. I'm gonna wait until it's at about 250 degrees and then I'm gonna cook it uh, with the top closed for, I would say about 15 to 20 minutes because there's onion and stuff in there too. So I want to ensure that that gets fully cooked. Okay, so it's preheated up to 250, it's on. We're gonna wait for 15 minutes. All right, we're gonna check this out. Tell you it's hot, that's for sure. Let's see how it's looking. That's looking pretty cooked to me. Well, that hoisin it smells amazing. All right, you gonna try a bite of this? See how it is. Oh wow, that's amazing. Mmm. Those flavors are just fantastic. All right, guys, I'm gonna enjoy this and uh, we'll see you in the next episode. Hands down, the best trout I've ever eaten. Like, no comparison, no competition, unreal.